what's up guys welcome back to another episode of Clark's Garage here we are <laughs> uh, I'm gonna apologize first for the shitty audio there's also a little clip of my car when it was running um, so today we are gonna go ahead and put the head back on to the block and hopefully I can assemble everything uh, I'll show you what we got we have a Tomei head gasket with the specs of a stock head gasket and also got ARP head studs so hmm, yeah that's all oh crap I need to go get my exhaust manifolds throws on before I put the head onto the block as you can see there, which is also ARP head um, exhaust manifold studs. I'll get that real quick and um, yeah, we'll get to it. Told me head gasket, finally opened it. So head gasket, I have a 90 millimeter, 90. Uh, came some stickers, some instructions, mainly in Japanese. Awesome. Oh man. Shared uh don't know how to read Japanese. Got some Turk sequences. Um some calculations. Oh here's English. Look, yay. <laughs> Alright, cool. Try to throw, throw this on and then try to put on the ARP head studs. I guess I'll do a little bit of an unboxing of that too because I haven't opened the box yet. So we'll go ahead and put this, this on. for the K24DE comes with a sticker some warranty information Installation instructions, torque sequence. Um, yeah, so this is basically the torque uh, amount of torque per foot pounds. And yeah, some uh, assembly lubricant, just like with the exhaust manifold studs, the washers. The bolts itself, and it is a 12 point, looks like 12 point size 12. I just got the nuts, and then the actual head stud itself.
All right, so the head is on, the bolts are on. I did hit a snag, so my 12 point, 12 millimeter socket, the only 12 point that I have is not reaching far enough to the nut. So I need to get a another socket where it's a lot thinner all the way in this point. If not, then I guess I'm gonna destroy the socket and I'm gonna grind it out. But I need to figure something out because as you can see it there. I can't reach. So um yeah, this is actually the most progress I've ever gotten in the last two weeks. So, got the heads on, head gaskets on, head studs are there. Exhaust manifold studs have been replaced. Um, yeah, this is as far as I can go for now. Uh, I don't know if I want to try putting the Eiler sprocket on at the moment. Because I do need to push the tensioner somehow. Let me figure out how I'm going to do with the tensioner. Uh, yeah. So I'm calling it a day for now, so I can either find a socket, I'll probably go check Home Depot in a little bit, hopefully I can find a socket, um, but that's basically it. I am missing about three more parts, it just came in the mail, so I can um, work on the intake manifold, one of it is an EGR block off plate, and I did order a clutch line, still braided. So that way it, I don't have to deal with the hard line. But um, that's it for now, I guess. Um, be safe, wash your hands, like, comment, subscribe. You know the deal. Hit the bell, whatever. <laughs> Peace out. Awesome.